so hey guys welcome to the new video today in this video we are going to see that how can you fix that error which is like gcc is not recognized as internal or external command so this error generally occurs when uh, you have uh, you have not correctly placed your path you have correctly not placed your gcc in the system path so what do you have to do let's move around vs code and let's check this error firstly I am just choosing a random folder and creating a file named as test.c. So this is our C program file. I will just write a basic code hash include stdio.h stdio.h After that I will define a main function. That's it. Let's save this file and run this code. Now you can see that uh, GCC is not recognized as internal or external command. So this error is coming because uh, you have not correctly placed your GCC in your system path. So let's close this and open now your environment variables. Edit the system environment variables. You will see this in windows. Then go in environment variables. Firstly let's move in our file manager. Then just go in uh, C disk. After going in C disk, you have to go in WinGW folder and then bin directory and uh, let's scroll down and you need to make sure that there is a folder named as there is an application named as gcc.exe and a cpp.exe. So just click here. Let me show you once again. Just click here in the empty bar and copy this one. You need to copy this and after that. Uh, just go in path here under system variables and edit this one you have to create a new path here and paste that was selected that's it click uh, click ok after that again ok and again ok so now let's move now vs code and try to run that program again let's close this again save this and now let's try running this again Now you can see that your error is gone. That uh, simply means you just need to add your system. Uh, you just need to add your bin directory of WinGW to your system variables so that it is accessible for the terminal. By this way, you can uh, resolve your error like in Python also. So that's it for this video, guys. Now let's see you next time.